Hello fans, this is Shadow Fury 333 with a bit of an announcement video. So we'll start off with a bit of good news. Good news is I'm going to remain casting. I will not stop 0k casting, but that is leading into the bad news, which is that I'm not going to be doing 0k FP VODs, or at least not reliably. Not on a regular schedule. I probably won't do them. I may if the fancy strikes me, but I doubt it. I just find them really frustrating. I was hoping I'd be able to get a format that was a bit of a different perspective, allowed people to watch and learn from watching me actually play, but I just find it really frustrating and that's just not good. It just wasn't working execution-wise. Maybe later, I might be able to figure out a way of making it work, but the experiment failed. Also, I probably won't be doing any more programming stuff for 0K for a while. I'm honestly starting to get a bit burnt out and that kind of ties into the previous point in that I wasn't playing a lot because I kept feeling like I'd log on and have to do programming stuff because it was a programming thing and I can do programming. And that wasn't a good thing. So yeah, I don't want to get burnt out on that. So I'm just going to take a break from the programming side. Sorry, Google Frog. I realize that's a bit of a pain, especially with the shader stuff coming up. But yeah, I just don't want to burn out. On to different news. So for those of you who are not aware, which is probably most of you, I rather enjoy the Dark Souls series. For a given value of enjoy, for anyone who knows the Dark Souls series, you'll know why that's for a given value. But I am planning on doing a Dark Souls 3 Let's Play. I've beaten Dark Souls 1, and I'm just about to beat Dark Souls 2, and I figured I'll do Dark Souls 3. With, I have a character concept for it, so I'll just do the same character in Dark Souls 3. And that's assuming that nothing changes with, say, crossbow weapon arts, for instance. Because if there's some really cool crossbow weapon arts, I'll probably do a second character focusing on that. But it'd have to be really cool. Like... I don't want, I guess, sort of a crossbow kata thing. If you had like gun kata with crossbows, I'd probably try to get a build around that. But otherwise, I know I want to do this one character concept. You'll see, you can see it in the video. Basically, Claymore, Crossbow, Miracles, and also Longsword is backup on the right hand. That's generally the idea. There's a couple other small things, but that's the big part. And lastly, so Skullgirl stuff, I mentioned something about a tournament at one point kind of offhand. I still kind of want to do that, but really what I want to do is just cast it. I want to be casting Skullgirls as well, rather than just playing it all the time. And I won't be doing a tournament anytime soon, but I do want to do spectated matches, just spectated exhibition matches, get some people to play a set while I commentate so I can get some experience commentating Skullgirls. Because there's a lot of little things with that game that's very different from Zero-K. I mean, Zero-K is very different from other RTS games doing commentary. There's a lot to learn, so I figure I might as well do it exhibition match style, rather than with tournaments. At least to begin. And that's about it. So yeah, have a good night, everyone.